this balloon powered rocket car to get us out of here and if you'd like to make a balloon powered rocket car at home all you'll need is some kind of bottle four bottle tops from a milk bottle or a juice bottle or anything a balloon two paper drinking straws and two wooden skewers. You want some tape or glue, a sharp pencil, and some scissors. What we'll do first is we'll take one of the straws and we want two pieces of straw about as wide as our bottle. So one and two. these onto the bottle. We can use tape or glue. Okay, and now for the wheels. This is a slightly tricky part, so you might want to get a grown-up to help you. We're going to take our plastic bottle top and we're going to poke a little hole in the middle of it. I'm going to use a sharp pencil. Very carefully, not hurt my fingers. And just a little hole. And we don't want the hole to be too big because we want it to fit nice and snugly onto our skewer. Oh, that looks tricky. So push it all the way on inside of the lid pointing out. We'll slot it through our little paper straw on the bottom of our bottle. And then we can fit another wheel. So there we are. Wow. And then through the pointy end of this skewer. And there's back wheels and then we do the same for the front wheel so they spin nicely up. now if you know someone with a pair of pliers if you like you can get them to snip these extra bits off and there we go, our bottle rocket car is on its way. Now, for the balloon propulsion system, we'll need a balloon and a second straw. We'll put the balloon onto the end. Just a little bit of tape. And we'll wrap it around nice and tightly. Again, you might want to get someone to help you with this part. You need it to be nice and airtight. We'll give a little test. Seems to work. Okay, now we can attach this to our car. I'm going to use some of this nice red tape. You could use glue. Like, remember to leave enough of the gap here so that you've got room to blow up the balloon. And then your car ready to go. That's great. 
And once you've made the basic parts of your car, you can decorate them in all sorts of different ways to make different races. So you've made one big enough. Now you can go and make another one big enough for the two of us. Ah. This isn't going to work either. Well, I've got another thing we could do. Might be the last thing that will work. Take a bit of newspaper, fold it in half, fold it in half one more time, then unfold it here. Now I've got a crease in the middle. I'm going to take this corner and fold it into the middle, like so, the other corner, like so, fold one bit of paper and leave one, turn it over and fold this bit as well. So, I'm going to open it here, it kind of looks like a hat. But it's not a hat, so you're going to push it in like this and flatten it. Then we're going to roll this corner up and so turn it over, fold this up like so. Remember how we opened it up like a hat? And now open this up like so. Flatten it down and this looks like a boat. Wow. We could sail home. Yeah, let's hop in. Uh, we've got the same problem. It's too small again, isn't it? to escape some of the pipe work, Iris. Ooh. Oh, and there's a leak! Uh -oh. oh no! 